Hi, Todd Warren here in the Forecast Center with a look at our weather week ahead here on ArcleTexHomepage.com as well as the ArcleTexHomepage.com app. And looking at the weather pattern, you can see what's taking shape here. We do have upper-level high pressure centered over southern New Mexico. Still far enough away that we are seeing those scattered showers and thunderstorms develop across especially the southern half of the area today, although we are seeing some rain across the north as well, but it is much more widespread over the southern sections of the area as we still have that disturbance, which is right along the uh, Gulf Coast of Texas and Louisiana uh, producing that shower and thunderstorm activity. Uh, we will see the ridge of high pressure trying to nudge things out just a touch here during the course of the next couple of days as the rain out there today will end this evening. Uh, we will see uh, another possibility for a few scattered showers and thunderstorms tomorrow. Probably will not see the coverage, but you can see the next disturbance uh, spinning its wheels there across the northern Gulf. It now appears that this will take a more northwesterly course and will move into perhaps uh, parts of southeast Texas, east Texas, and will increase our rainfall chances as we move into the end of the Labor Day weekend, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. Pretty good shot for some showers and thunderstorms across the Arkletex with some decent rainfall totals expected, as I'll show you here in a second. Well, for the next couple of days, you can see the scattered showers and thunderstorms that we uh, will be seeing here this evening. Notice that activity quickly falls apart as we go through the nighttime hours tonight. As we go through your Thursday, expect a mix of clouds and sunshine. I think it will be warmer tomorrow because we will not see as many clouds. It will not probably not see the coverage of the rainfall across the region. As you can see, uh, heading into the latter stages of the afternoon, the spotty nature of uh, the shower and thunderstorm activity across the region. That will end tomorrow evening and then Friday we do it all over again with that mix of clouds and sunshine. Again a slight chance for the pop-up shower or thunderstorm mainly during the heat of the afternoon. If you get some rain tomorrow or Friday consider yourself lucky if you need some as we are looking at uh, again uh, very limited rainfall across the region not only for tomorrow and Friday but also Saturday as well. Again rainfall potential this is our model taking you through the weekend and you can see it's showing uh, basically through Sunday a uh, good quarter to a half an inch due to the spotty uh, shower and thunderstorm activity that we uh, have out there now and could see uh, through Saturday and Sunday uh, but here's another model which takes us out through the middle of next week and it is taking into account the disturbance that I mentioned in the uh, Gulf of Mexico for Sunday Monday Tuesday and you can see it is showing rainfall totals a good solid inch across much of the area good possibility with the heaviest totals possibly closer to two inches over the southern sections of the Arkletex so it looks like some more needed rain at least a better chance of that happening with more coverage possible uh, to start next week or at least uh, to close the uh, long holiday weekend in the meantime temperatures tonight uh, will be uh, once again above normal as we'll see lows in the low to middle 70s, including 74 in Shreveport and 73 in Texarkana. Daytime highs tomorrow should rebound back up into the uh, mid-90s, low to middle 90s actually, 91 in Dequeen and Hope, 93 in Texarkana, 96 in Shreveport, 95 degrees for the high temperature tomorrow in Marshall. So here's a review of your seven-day forecast. Start you off with Shreveport numbers, highs mid-90s through Saturday. Notice we will get a little bit closer to normal Sunday, Monday, Tuesday with that better shot for the showers and thunderstorms. Nighttime lows during this time frame likely will begin in the mid 70s will settle into the low to middle 70s in Shreveport. As far as Texarkana you're looking at rainfall chances probably not quite as high as uh, you'll, you're looking at a 10% chance not 140% chance but 10% chance for Saturday. Uh, daytime highs lower 90s in the week ahead with overnight lows for the most part in the low to middle 70s. So all in all it does appear as if we are looking at uh, conditions across the Oracle text that will stay near or above normal in the week ahead. Uh, rainfall chances will go down for the next couple of days, but will increase once again to close the Labor Day weekend.